gentlemen. Maybe you're wondering why I'm out here this afternoon, and uh, I do wonder myself sometimes, but uh, as you can see, I'm a little bit of an artist, and I want to show you what I've got on my board here. Just before I begin, I'll draw my yellow lines on my board, and then I'll start. Now, I always draw yellow lines on my board. You know what? That's right. <laughs> to stop the cars barking on my board. I'm going to make some yellow letters in here with my black paintbrush. And I'm going to ask you a question. Learning, you know, but if it's 
not in earning, and a man's life does not consist in the abundance of his possessions. It's something else very famous. Some people say, or they used to say, it's not so popular now, but the answer to life is that to quality life is that you have to change society. And uh, basically, the answer is revolution, and you have to, instead of learning and earning, you've got to sort of burn everything down, change everything. And of course, in the 20th century, there are plenty of so revolutionaries that said, well, you've got to change society, change the structures, and burn everything down, start again, make a more equal, just, egalitarian society. And that's the answer to a quality life for everybody. But is it? No? I saw a young man at Yaristi, I talked to him actually. Yeah, very interesting, he had a Che Guevara t-shirt on him. Now even today, Che Guevara was a revolutionary, believed in changing the world, changing society, burning things down, starting again. Still a cult hero for many people. But he said this, interestingly enough. He says that it doesn't matter how much you change society and change the structures, unless you can change the heart of man, all you end up with is greed and lust and ambition. Very insightful. You see, what he realized was this, that the heart of the human problem is the problem of the human heart. So the answer is not in learning. Bertrand Russell, those that know the most and the most miserable, it's not in earning, Paul Getty, tunneling through a mountain of gold, not in the next of happiness. It's not burning, Che Guevara saying you have to change the heart of man. What is the answer to a quality life? Well, I believe it's in a person, not a philosophy, not a religion, not through learning or earning, but a person. 2,000 years ago said, I have come to give you life and life to the full. That person is none other than Jesus Christ. He's the one that says a man's life does not consist of the abundance of his possessions. He's the one that said you should know the truth and the truth shall set you free. He's the one that offered not just a change in society, but a change in a person's heart. He's the one that 2,000 years ago died to deal with that problem of the human heart, like greed, selfishness, lust and ambition that spoils our life, spoils our world, spoils our society, spoils our environment. The Bible calls us sin. He died on the cross so we can be forgiven. And the most important thing in our life, our relationship with God, that many people ignore, can be put right. And I'm here today as a Christian, not to ask for your money, not to sell you something, but to tell you today the answer to quality life, the answer to life to the full, and not only that, life forever is found in Jesus Christ and in doing this. In turning to Him, in turning to God. Maybe you've never thought about it, but if you want to give it some thought, I've got a little leaflet, all to you God, what make you a Christian, and you tell me some more, give me a bit more food for thought. Thanks for listening. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.